Okay, a uh, quick video. This is, as you can see, Lara Croft Go. It's the port of a mobile game. So it has. Oh, let's see if we can get the volume down a bit. There we go. So uh, it's uh, touch oriented controls. It's similar to the uh, Hitman Go game which got uh, released for Linux uh, I forget, six months ago, a bit longer oh I didn't want to do that, that's what I wanted to do, right uh, so it's basically a, a turn based puzzle game I will, let's do one of the earlier levels just to uh, just to get the feel of that see so I've, I've played this bit I've played this level a little oh this one was quite an annoying level the first time so it is a little bit trial and error and the, to figure out what stuff does you sometimes just have to die I don't I mean I can't see any uh, any environment cues to tell you what you should be a uh, what should we be doing? Right, so this one slides, that's it, right. So then when that breaks, we fall down onto it. See, all the controls are, are touch, touch, slide controls. Here we go. And that'll break. We'll see a mysterious snake moving. So this is where you find the key and move on to the next level. I'm going to go back and yes, and then do the do a level as far as I've got so far. Where did I get to? This is where I got to. Let's do this one then. So this this has introduced some more mechanics by the look of it, right? Yeah. There's things to pick up. And picking up picking up things unlocks uh, outfits and stuff. Trial and error. So, if you buy this on Android or similar, I presume. So I can't go back up this way. If you buy this on Android similar, it's about two quid or something. On Steam, I think the price. There we go. That's what I needed to do. Well, that's not what I needed to do. <sighs> Sorry, this is slightly frustrating, but but there you go. Yeah, it's about two quid on Android. On Steam, I think the retail price is about a tenner, or possibly nine quid. Which seems excessive. There is a launch discount, which I have taken advantage of in order to uh, purchase and play for it now. So we need that to go. There we go. 
it's still much more expensive than getting an Android. But on the other hand, it's a Square Enix game available on Linux. And generally, I'm in favour of that sort of thing. And would like to encourage more of it. Oh, there's a thing. There we go. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there we go. So, yes. It is definitely a mobile game experience. I don't understand how I can get past this one. Yeah. That. Oh, there's a switch. There's always a switch. That's better. It's a uh, turn-based puzzle game. It's uh, based in the Lara Croft franchise. There's collectibles, there's puzzles, there's outfits, there's, there's um, a lot of cost compared to the mobile version of the game. But it's available on 81 Linux, day one release. Pros and cons, I guess. Pros and cons. I don't know if it's worth the price it is now, but, you know, I've bought it. Check it out if you've not got it on Android. Consider whether it's um, whether it's worth it to you to uh, be encouraging Square Enix to um, uh, put more games. Anyway, there you go. Lara Croft Go. Uh, available today for Linux.